subscribe, love, like. We're sponsored by the Spunk Lube and rebroadcast by the Demon Seed Radio Network. We could not do any of this without you guys. Thank you so much for listening. Uh, please give us that bump. Porn stars are people podcast. I'm here with. So wait, you're you're fucking uh, on your thing. It's like bat. It's Bathory cunt on your thing still. Yeah, on so my, you always like, confuse me, yeah. Yeah. So I'm here with Estella, come, Estella Bathory. Hey, Bathory. what's up? How, how do you say it correctly? Bathory. Okay, I, 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 I believe we must have gone through It never through sounds this. right when I say it. No, though. it doesn't sound right when anyone says it's best it's too late to change it now. I mean. Oh, is that where you're at? <laughs> yeah. Somebody did that. Maybe Somebody literally changed, changed their name it. halfway through their career. That's weird. What? Yeah. Oh, it's a ridiculous, ridiculous idea. I'll tell you who it is off, off cast. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Um, so yeah, so okay, so, so uh, it's been, uh, I, well, I've been trying to meet up with you for like three days. You uh, lost <laughs> communication <laughs> abilities. Well, tell me what happened. Oh, you didn't well. want to tell me off cast, so tell me. Um, I lost my phone this morning. Yeah. Yeah, well, I've, I've only been out of phone for two hours, so that's not an excuse. What time did you lose the phone? Oh, it was like 10 a.m. Oh, so you were like up being a person. You yeah, weren't I, was, like being I a, was sober. Like, you weren't I being like a maniac. No, I wasn't lit. You know, oh, I, I thought you were a maniac. Getting okay, lit cool. in Vegas and just losing <laughs> your phone. No, that's not what happened. Oh. Although so last night I did get a bit lit. Yeah. So, yeah. Some shit went down, but I'll tell you that later. Okay. Um, but no, no, off I, cast. I lost my phone um, this morning at the gas station. What? Yes. Why I went can't there. you go back? Well, it was gone. It was gone already. Who steals phones anymore? Well, I'm staying in a really sketchy area. You said, yeah, you're staying in downtown. Yeah. Downtown it's is... scary. Downtown has this vibe of... So downtown used to be the Strip. Then it, then the Strip was the Strip. Yeah. Then they're trying to remake downtown the Strip. It's what it feels like. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not an expert or anything. I don't know anything. I I'm got here two days ago. This place is yeah. fucking bananas. I don't know what's going it's on. First time in Vegas. Yeah, it's oh. weird. It's weird. And yeah. I lost my phone. I've already been... Uh, every person uh, other than... There's like a small group of people that have taken care of me since I've been here, but like there was a large group of people that were like, "We got you when you come to Vegas," and then when I got here, they were like, "We don't got you." Fucking hell! Yeah, shit. So I came a week early, and that week was yeah. treachery, because it was like I didn't have. So I, I so finally I said, "Fuck it, I'm gonna stay closer to things." Gotta gotta like I, I just threw a bunch of money at it, solved the problem. Mm -hmm. So now I'm now I'm all now I'm all straight away. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So this story wasn't even a story. It was just you left at the gas station. Yeah. Well, then I, I didn't realize I was microwaving a burrito, <laughs> which was disgusting. But this isn't like an American thing. Yeah, we love it. Yeah, uh, yeah, you do. Um, <laughs> yeah, that, that's a choice. That's cho <laughs> cho choices are made. Um, yeah. Yeah. So I put I put my phone on top of this shelf or something and i thought oh don't leave your phone there <laughs> right isn't every time you I do did. that every time you do the like hey i'm not gonna do this then yeah that's then you, you do, do it. right so every don't time. don't do anything is the answer yeah. to that this is this is a big thing that i do when i'm packing so in like a weird in like a special way or i'm like i just want to clean up my place because i've got people coming to stay i'm yeah. like put this here so that you don't forget where it's at and then I and come then you back will and completely no and is. that's what i did it's out of and routine we left we went back to our hotel uh <laughs> which is a bit <laughs> Yeah, you don't <laughs> like the hotel either. It's it's a choice um, <laughs> that was made, and so you don't like the hotel either. You don't like any no, of not really. So it's just it's just a bit of a. I feel we're in a bit of a rough area, and yeah. Then I, I realized I'd lost my left my phone, so I ran back to the gas station. It was obviously gone. So then, I don't, I don't, what? I don't understand people stealing phones in 2020. Because then they could. They, I don't know. I mean, I hope that they got some money for it at the pawn shop and they bought you some crack or whatever it is that they <laughs> wanted. So the first thing Tindra and I did, yeah. we started messaging it like in caps lock. Yeah, of course. Like cash reward. Yeah. Las Vegas, course. we said our hotel. And I was like, I'll give you $500. And it was right in the hotel. Yeah. And then I was like, we like we know that my phone is in the possession of like a crackhead. Yeah. And the first thing we have a direct line. Right, the I guess first thing we're doing is saying our location. <laughs> like here we are. So now they're at your hotel right now. Just Maybe. Cleaning it out. Now they know where we are. I they're don't know why I did out. that. Yeah. Yeah. Um, you didn't tell them the room. <laughs> you told them the room? No, I didn't tell them the room. Okay. No, we yeah, we held back on that. I was like, actually maybe we shouldn't be Is it what is your what is your Hey There's <laughs> freshy juice over there. there. What is your I'm trying to what is your screen? Is the screen a picture of you? No. Okay. No, that's lame. I know, it's like good. I hate it when people do that. Well, I'm saying I it would be bad. It. And they're like, Oh, this is whose phone it is. Yeah. I uh, no, I hate that What what's your lock screen? My, my, my dog. Oh yeah. It's the greatest thing. Oh ah, yeah, that's a good picture. <laughs> The greatest way yeah, to go. So, uh, and yeah, I no hate this phone I just got. I actually hate it. Why? You've had it for 15 minutes. I've had it for 15 minutes. Yeah, I hate it. Is it not the what you had before? It's a Samsung, and I, I lost an iPhone, and it's it feels like. Oh, I've why would you go Android? I don't know why I did that. Why did you do that? You I have an American know. number now, though. So you, yeah, I have an American number now. So this life. is lit. But that was more than 500 dollars, probably. 
Yeah, a little bit. About 550. Five, oh, okay, so it's, it's the But same. this is good because this is the newest Samsung. It has a really good camera. So, yeah, yeah I'm going to make some porn with make it. Make some I pornography. Yeah. yeah. With it. I guess what I do. You know, <laughs> it's my job. <laughs> make some pornography with it. Yeah. Um, do you do you find that the handheld <laughs> camera, like the the camera phone stuff, is is um, it seems like it's a, it's content. Phone cameras are great it's good now. enough. Yeah. They're amazing. They're amazing. Most cameras are four K now yeah. on phones. Um, really, there's no reason not to. I think there was definitely this period of time when people were like, "Oh God, I don't want to film on a phone," and yeah. I was definitely like that. I was totally like that. You can I was get like, like cages no. for them and like all. all but the seriously, things, yeah. yeah, like it's it's four like K, and you can have um. You and know, you really, you can have a lot of adjustable lens features. Lens adapters, on them. all the things. Yeah, you can adjust the ISO and, and, and stuff then I like think that with on, these, you can f- yeah, on you most can phones now. The iPhone camera was amazing that I lost this morning. And um, yeah, I'm going oh, well, to... I'll just that throw one another now. one, yeah. <laughs> 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 just off. Yeah, apparently it's Thank good. God we weren't doing this uh, above a pool. Have um, you been doing podcasts about No, but I'm saying you just threw your phone and we would be in the pool now. I'm just trying to set the scene for, for you fucking up. That's all. Yeah. Yeah, so my friend um, went to stay at a hotel in Dubai where the balcony was over uh, like this a large open air aquarium. Yeah. And there was just like sharks and all this shit. That's great. Off the balcony. And I, no, I hated it. Do I, you, I hated it. Do I was you get like, that I never vibe you like, go there. But do you feel like when you're standing over that you're going to hurl yourself off? Yeah, I get that feeling. I have like constant intrusive thoughts. I'm like, I'm like, <laughs> where's the tube? And I'm like, throw yourself in front of it, do it now. <laughs> you know? And then it's like, no, no. Yeah. Like, really? punch that person in the face. <laughs> like, oh, what if you said this? Oh, really? Yeah, all the time. And it's like, I'm constantly holding back from doing this, no this fucked up stuff because of society and i just feel that i wouldn't really enjoy being on a balcony above a fucking pool of sharks you just hurl in also i think it's scary as fuck like that scares me large things in water scares yeah. me so I much i was stung by a stingray when i was a kid so i'm still fucked up like did ocean someone wise. um piss on it to is that jellyfish that's jellyfish sorry yeah. i just you can, <laughs> yeah. pee on, you can pee on my foot if you want oh my god the um that's on camera yeah so okay. the uh, it's locked in. Thanks. So the um Ooh. no the no so here's so this is what happened. So I got stung <laughs> I got stung in the foot by a stingray. It was the other foot, but uh, I don't want to move my foot. So it's it the other foot, but it got stung right there, and I barely got it. Okay, because okay. I could On feel the ball it, of and your I was foot. jumping it's up, the ball and I was of like, his foot. and I was ju- no, it was like it was like my toe, and I was like jumping up and okay. down, and I was like I was like oh my god, something bit me, whatever, whatever, and then they and then I go back to like the hotel areas in Tampa. We'll go back to the hotel areas called the Don Cesar, and they <laughs> had a bucket, and written on the side of the bucket in Sharpie said Stingray bucket. Oh, and so was there a stingray in the bucket? No, <laughs> no, no. So it was when you get you, when you get stung by a stingray, you got to put whatever you got stung in this bucket. So they filled it with like hot tub water, and I just had to sit with this hot tub water on my foot. Because supposedly the venom will work its way out. Oh, thank goodness! You know, you're lucky because that's how they got Steve, Steve Owen. Yeah. Well, he took a yeah. he took it through his heart, so that's how that's a <laughs> that's, a good thing. that's a very very yeah. different. Yeah. They they wanted it. they were determined with him. So with you, it was. This is yeah. what's fun about the Steve Owen situation. <laughs> Um, what's fun about the situation of the dead man man. that's a fun situation here's what it is every person who's an expert in their field (laughs) once they die of what they're the expert of then every like thing that they did along the way gets called into question Okay. So the, like, we, like once Steve Irwin died, we we're like, yeah, you can't just go up grabbing crocodiles. And <laughs> it's not yeah. the way to do it. The Atkins guy died because his heart exploded, <laughs> right? And so we're like, yeah, you can't just eat bacon all the time. Like it's not how it works. <laughs> and then so I'm just waiting for the dog whisperer guy. Isn't that what you eat? Yeah, I eat, no, I don't eat bacon. I don't eat pork at all, actually. I, oh, really? I literally just eat... Uh, Are you I, still, like, I full paleo? Eat, I just eat red meat. But yeah. here's the kicker. I just got my blood test results, and my cholesterol's up. So it's... Fuck! Yeah, so I got it. So I got, so it's I'm, happening. So I'm going <laughs> to so have to become a vegetarian soon. Okay. Well, that's really the star of what I'm eating anyway, is the vegetarian stuff. Is, right. is like, if you, if you... Since... Since you remember this about my diet, I feel like you're looking at my my food <laughs> choices. But so the like, all the I stuff just like food. is the steak, and then all the stuff to the right of the steak is like really where is where it shines. Yeah, the ribeye yeah, yeah. is dope. No. But then all the veggie stuff. I'm oh doing yeah, is really, no, is really I, I couldn't better. agree more. I, I love a vegetable. Yeah, I love a vegetable. Yeah. Just one. Um, <laughs> no, but so the like the dog whisperer, like he's gonna get mauled one day. You know that guy? He's he's like on Discovery Channel. Right. He like just stabs like uh, he just like pokes. Uh, stabs. He pokes. <laughs> He p- yeah, he, st- he pokes pit oh, bulls in the side. Like I was seeing the other night. Yeah, yeah, he pokes pit bulls in the side. He goes, tss, 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 and like eventually when he gets mauled, we're going to be like, you can't just poke a pit bull in the side of the neck. That's no, not going to work out. No. It's an 85-pound pit bull. But no one's going to say this until, until he, he dies. Gets, yeah. Well, I guess that 
Yeah. Someone's got to do it. Yeah. So if anybody dies in porn of just like of just anal, they're gonna be like, yo, you can't just you can't be <laughs> anally fisted. It's it's actually that's what happened to that lady. That's the uh, the the queen of England, right? The, what? Uh, when she got killed by the horse, what? right? Didn't that happen? She got killed by a horse. What? He's uh, he's the lower the queen of England. <laughs> This is what we have left over in our in our country. Is all we know is that the Queen of England likes to fuck horses. Is that's that not true? Not <laughs> that's not. I think fact. that's true. It feels like a fact. That's not real. Who's the lady who fucked horses? That's not the Queen of England. <laughs> Who's the lady who fucked horses? I don't know. In England, you had one. Hey Siri, who's the lady who fucked <laughs> horses in England? They can't translate it in English. Hey, who's the lady who fucks horses in England? <laughs> Let's see if it's serious. I couldn't find anything on the web. All right, well, fair enough. I'm going to keep it's Googling. But you don't have a Siri. Oh, he's Australian. Oh, my God. That's he's, great. he's an Australian man. Yeah, he's, he's hot. Oh, fuck yeah. He's hot. If I had no. Yeah, he is. No. If it's I hadn't uh, lost my iPhone this morning, I would change mine. Yeah. But now I got this Samsung. I hate it. I what, is, what do you say to the Samsung? You go, hey, hey, Google. Uh, but does it have it? You go, hey, Google. Hey, Google. <laughs> Excuse me, Google. Hey, Google. Google? Hey. Yeah, Android is Google, right? Google. Excuse me. La lady who fucks Hey, horse. Google. <gasps> okay. Did it work? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Lady up. who fucks horses um, in England. <laughs> <laughs> who is the lady who fucks horses? Who is the lady who okay, fucks Google. horses in England? Oh, it's OK, Google. Okay. OK, Google. Oh, I'm setting up my voice thing. All right. Well, th oh, we don't hey, have time Google. for this. It wants me to mix it up. Hey, Google. Sounds great. We Next. don't we don't have time for this. Um, there was a lady who supposedly was a uh, was a horse fucker in England. Oh, we'll have to Google that. I, I can't mean, get any information. I mean, yeah, maybe in you don't have this information. Germany? No, no, I, I this no, I'm, this I'm sorry. I didn't I didn't bring that to the table. <laughs> <laughs> like, this is not how yeah, you, this is not yeah. how you feel about your own country. Um. Well, no, good on her. I mean, <laughs> yeah. And then there was I'm the sure guy. there's more than one. Well, there was the guy here that that videoed it. He got he got fucked to death by a horse on yes, camera. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. I definitely that was you know, an American. I, I've definitely I've seen that one. Yeah. <laughs> you saw it? Yeah, I think I never saw like it. Like years and years ago, I was like, oh, should we watch it? Like Google it. And I was Everybody like, oh, wanted to watch it. Yeah, I never got it. I never got my. I never got yeah. a chance to see it. There was a uh, there was a comedian who did it. I think it was Dave Chappelle did a thing about it about mm. how there's a moment where the horse looks back at the camera and then <laughs> makes a decision <laughs> and then just tears this guy apart. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we went dark. We're there. We're there. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so you are in Las Vegas for almost two and a half, three weeks. Yeah. I was. I was about to to ask you a question. Oh about yeah, yeah please. Fucking. Okay. You, you were framing a question about animal fuck. I didn't know what your brain was doing. You have to pick an animal. To fuck. You go pick. One. Why? <laughs> what situation am I in that I need to pick it in? This is what happens a lot on dating sites. They go, they go. If you had to eat one, if you had, <laughs> you to, eat, if you had to eat one to thing fuck. for the rest of your life, what would you eat? And it's like uh, that's never gonna happen. Yeah, I've seen these questions. Yeah, like they're like, like we'll kill your mother, and I was like, why? How is this what the killer wants? Yeah, yeah. Like <laughs> okay. there isn't a situation. I'll play along. I'll play along. Yeah. You, you like, say yours first. There's never a situation where this would happen. It's never gonna happen. If you had Ever. to, fuck, no, if I was forced to rape an animal for the rest of my life. Hi, guys in the lift. Sorry, Good to see sorry you. about that. Um, they don't know what lift means. That's That was the oh, most yeah, confusing part like, of that. What? That was the most confusing part of that thing. They were like, fucking animals, we understand. Lift, we don't. Um, <laughs> okay. If uh, you had I don't one. know. Let me think. Wait, um, wait. So, so am I, so this is a consensual relationship? Oh, yeah, fully, fully. It wants to fuck me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, there's okay. no rape involved. Okay, so. No, it, I wouldn't if bring it, that up. If it wants to fuck me. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's really. It's really attracted to me. Yeah. And it wants to fuck me. And I get my choice. <laughs> okay. I've always there's a dolphin thing. There's always like they say the dolphin. Oh, pussy. dolphins rape they people. Say, no, I've heard. Yeah. They I've say heard. dolphin, but they say dolphin pussy is good. <laughs> yeah. Do you know that? Oh, this is. I, I probably talked about this last time on this podcast with you. <laughs> was the fox thing? Foxes rape cats. <laughs> In England. No, I didn't know. That. Yeah, that's a real thing. In England. What? In <laughs> what is it? Like? <laughs> what is it with England? What do you think happens there? <laughs> like, what we do don't, you think we're there's doing? There's no foxes raping cats here. We don't have so foxes. You're coming out with all this weird <laughs> sex about England. <laughs> hey Siri. <laughs> hey Siri. Do foxes rape? Is that working? Hey Siri. Do foxes rape cats in England? Okay, I found this on the web for do foxes rape cats in... It didn't even find the other thing, so this is for sure true. Okay. Rapists are compared to other animals. Yeah, for sure. They're raping, they're raping in the animal kingdom. Foxes. foxes raping, raping the look, animal kingdom. Look at it. You know what? There was so an interesting thing in London. Yeah. Um, there was a cat murderer in Croydon uh, like a few years a ago. A human being. 
<laughs> well, presumably a human being. We don't know. And they were doing weird shit, like cutting up people's cats. Yeah. And, uh, you know, laying out their insides all over the place. Yeah. But then Which is what cats do to other animals, so it's kind of Yeah, fair. but it was like surgical. Yeah. And then they would do fucked up shit. Like they would put the collar like on the doorstep like a month ah. later and stuff like that. That's creepy. Or put like the cat's head like in the garden. Yeah. Yeah, like weird ass like shit. So they were. Well, what was he called? Well, I mean, we'll probably find out in 20 years when he gets arrested for murdering humans. Oh, he's still making it happen. Yeah, because yeah. So they were investigating this, I guess this, a cat right? is a starter human. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, totally, of course. It is a starter human. I dissected a lot of cats when I went to university. What? Did you? Like, yeah. You we know. don't do that in this country. That's in, that's a British thing. That's what I said. You guys yeah, are yeah, fucked yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's all, it's all British shit. <laughs> <laughs> like, um, so then the police goes to the case and they were like, nah, it's foxes. What? And everyone was like, it's literally not foxes. It's yeah, very clear that this has been surgically cut and all of this. Foxes aren't carrying around a scalpel. Maybe. <laughs> like, you don't know. No. No, but um, I, I do find it interesting. I watched that Don't Fuck With Cats documentary. On oh, I haven't watched it yet. I'm it's excited. Oh, oh, the only takeaway that I'll, that I'll give you that doesn't ruin it is how little an investigator really wants to do. Okay. So that's the thing. That's like, it's like watching that documentary made me realize like I can murder whoever I want. They're never going to catch Fucking me. A, yeah. It's that easy. If I don't know the person, I can murder them and they're never going to find me. Who? It's so right. easy. Okay. Any person. Any person that you don't know, you can yeah. murder. Like just, Did you want to murder? I don't want to murder anybody yet, but, but now I'm going to start making a list. I mean, so you, it's something to bear in mind. Oh, that's the other half of this joke. I keep forgetting because it doesn't right. go good. The f I'm trying to do this joke about murder, but the 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 the, the big holdup, the big like big thing that like props this whole thing up is that nobody like there's nobody on earth trying to murder me because I'm a good person. So if you're a good person, people aren't trying to murder. Well, you. I don't know. I so mean, I don't think you'd know about so it. If you get murdered, the stingray had to go. If you <laughs> if you get murdered by another person, it's because you can't maybe a little bit that you're a dick. Like that's like there's a little bit of that. Yeah. Like let's remove serial killers. Okay, but let's remove like, 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 like sex crimes. What about shootings? There was a shooting in the mall the other day. I yeah, opposite, nobody, actually. nobody died, yeah. No, two people got injured. Yeah. But what were they? I think they were just there. Look, it's just they? It wasn't be, like, it's oh, I, I know where they are. It's I'm supposed to go be a fun them. joke. It's not there. supposed to be a thing you break down. Okay, go ahead. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, let the, you let the fox's rape thing ride, but you won't let my murder thing ride. That's funny. No, so the. Okay, yeah. so wait, you didn't pick your animal. Oh, what animal that I'm going to fuck? Yeah. You brought it up. Um. Maybe an eel. Maybe an eel. You're just thinking about dick-like animals. No, I mean. But what if he keeps going? Maybe, and then eel and I would have like a more of a romantic relationship. Yeah, you know? I wouldn't. It just happens that he's very phallic. Maybe but a you're stingray. Never gonna, <laughs> but you're never gonna. I, can you fuck a stingray? Here's well, here. Okay, so go. this. Well, here's what's interesting is, yeah. um, as a dude, I I get the winning side of this because I can basically fuck anything. Yeah, you can't well, fuck I mean, as many what, things. What is sex, really? You know, like what is sex? Sex is at the beginning and oh, the penetration, this? right? Now it we're doing it. this. <laughs> you st so you started with sex which animal would you fuck, and now you're like, well, listen, sex can be a lot of things. Like <laughs> yeah. you can give a, you can give a rabbit a hand yeah, job. Like maybe I wanted to like <laughs> caress the wing of a beautiful golden eagle, I would and maybe that would be enough for me. I found this fact out very recently, within the last 24 hours. Did you know that owls have long legs? I fucking love owls. Owls really have long legs. Yeah, no, I know. Yeah, they're it's so nuts. funny. They look like they're wearing pants. Yeah, it's weird. Yeah, yeah, it's so weird. I would fuck an owl. Oh, this is very little. That now beak. that you brought it up, now it's taking a weird turn. But now that you brought it up, I I would fuck anything consensually. Anything. Yeah, yeah. It's like, cause once you're <coughs> here's the thing. Once you're like making the making that list, then there's really no end to it. Cause you're like, okay, well, look, I fucked a dolphin, so I may as well fuck a shark. I may as well <coughs> fuck. I just wouldn't want to do it in the water. I think that's a bit scary. I think that's the whole point to oh, fuck I'm a dolphin. I'm scared of that. Like I don't really like. Can the dolphin come here? <laughs> if it'll come here, I think a dolphin. I'll will consider it. if it comes to me. I think a dolphin will fuck you on his back on the ground. So I think you're good with that. Yeah. All right. Yeah. 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 I think dolphins have raped people before. Yeah, I've heard that they have. I've googled it a lot, and not that much comes. <laughs> you googled it a lot. I have googled it, yeah, because I wanted to know the facts. Our search history this week is going to be very strange. <laughs> <laughs> we're on a list. You got a new phone, so you're fine. Yeah, we're yeah. On, we're on a list now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't log into Definitely. any of your stuff. No. Because then you can Google some weird shit for a yeah, while. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be assigned to a new FBI agent. Yeah. It's a USA number. What are you? Who's your FBI? The British <laughs> um, Interpol? What do you have? Who's your FBI? It's MI5, isn't it? Is it real? So is here, it real? Is it? This is literally like this is how dumb Americans are <laughs> because it was because it's like what James Bond is. We just go, oh, that's probably not a real thing. It, yeah, it, it is. 
<laughs> I, I have a friend who's like really into this either. stuff. Like, I, yeah, and I'm like, I, I definitely had conversations about this. No, I'm like, is it? Who, is, who are the British? Is it what's who are the James Bond and what's real? Who's in, who, the inspector? <laughs> British inspector. <laughs> yeah. What is James Bond and what is real? Well, uh, yeah, that's the question. <laughs> These are the moments. These are the moments we have to figure out. Yeah, that's the question. Hilarious. But um all right, well this is taking a weird turn. Um yeah. so that's cool. What uh what's the rest of your week like? Are you you're filming out here, supposedly, because you have your phone to film on? Yes. Um yeah, hopefully I'm gonna be pegging someone today, which is great and exciting. I hate when I um, when this happens and then I don't remember. Which one's pegging? Pegging is fucking a guy with a strap on. Got it. Yeah. Why is it so why is this such a complicated I for every time I think pegging is um like swallowing your own cum. Why do I think that? What why is that do called? You think that? I don't know, what is that called? Because what it's called. called. It has a name. It, does, it's a it has a name. I don't think it has a name. It for sure has a name. S- hey Siri. Okay. Right. <laughs> <laughs> hey Siri. <laughs> Wait, no. So, um, no. Yeah. So I don't know no, why. Why does it have to be called pegging? It seems so. Um, it's just so natural. I it's so normal and natural. It shouldn't have a weird name. Yeah, just say fucking a guy with a strap on. Yeah. I don't know. Um, I read recently. I think someone made that term up like long after it yeah. was a thing. Yeah. But I thought it was also associated with. Um, with du- with dudes, with dudes. I think it's just. It, well, it I think it it's is, just like when you fuck a dude. With yeah, yeah, yeah. If you fuck a girl with it, they don't tend to say pegging. Okay. No, you say just say strap oning. Yeah, strap oning. Strap oning. This is where our language yeah. came from, guys. And sh- this is. But yeah, um, <laughs> no, I I'm very, I I feel like a real affinity with the male prostate. You feel like a what? I feel an affinity with the prostate. It's a really good area. I see. You know, yeah. oh, wait, what are we talking about? You're talking about now. You're prostate, talking about actual pegging. Prostate. You're talking about actual pegging. I yeah. thought you were talking about how you feel when you have a dick strapped on. You're not. You're talking about. Yeah, I know. I'm talking about the G spot. Yeah. In man's asshole. The male G spot. Why did you? Well, it's not up there. No, that's where you went. <laughs> Is that up here? You don't know. <laughs> Shaquille. How far in do I have to go to, to um, get it? Can I get to it? <laughs> on my own. You could give it with a no help. Give it a go. With no help, can I get to it? I'm in my 30s. I, mean, I don't want anything going up anymore. <laughs> I don't trust it up there anymore. In my 20s. Have you ever had a doctor check it? No, no, no. I'm in my you 30s. You should. No, 40s I can. Oh, okay. Now You're going to wait. Leave it. Yeah. All right, yeah, yeah. 40s is when you start getting people in there. Yeah. Well, I mean, everyone's at a different kind of height. Yeah. But it's sort of like, it tends to be sort of like just like a little bit like there. It used to be like, it usually is like the floor length of my fingers. Okay. At least. And then it's like a bit of a push, and it's like. And you give it a little tickle. More of like a ch- like a massaging <laughs> <laughs> motion. What was the sound? <laughs> What's the ch? I don't know where that came no. from. No. More of like a ch. That's just for when I'm fucking the dolphin later. Yeah. <laughs> I was so excited that you did that. <laughs> um. So an eel, you would have a romantic... Eels are very ugly. I don't know. I always say eel when people are like, what's your favorite animal? I'm like, an eel. Because oh, it pisses people off. Why? Because <laughs> it's a shit animal. <laughs> 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 like it's what's just your, what's your no one a- ever expects you to say it. So what's I your actual favorite it. animal? Um, Owls. I love an owl, I've got to say. So I mean, you know, they're overdone, but they've always been there. What do you mean they're overdone? They're overdone. Owls are. People you know, say owl too much. Like a bit, no, it's just like a bit of a basic bitch favorite animal. Like there's oh. owls and everything. Isn't I don't it? think that's true. Yeah, I think it's a bit. No, la- no. The basic it's bitch animal right now is uh, sloth and llama. Oh, sloths and llamas Those and are the pugs. Basic bitch animal. Yeah, basic yeah. Bitch animals. Yep. Yeah, they're that's proper. Sloths are great though. No, they really are. It's. I remember. Yeah. I ha- I had a I. I when I was first gathering information as a child, where I like decided that knowing things was fun, I had this sloth and I had this book about like everything that was the biggest, smallest, and slowest. And yeah. Was, uh, and then I, I started. Get and then I started reading. Well, you can just take these off, probably. And then I started take reading, off. and they just start taking stuff off. Oh. And then I started reading like Guinness Book of World Records and trying to find shit. Yeah. Find out more information. Yeah. Look at these. These are these are these are like are these Doc Martens. Yeah. Are these actual Doc Martens? Actually, no. No, something they else. They are different brands. They're so heavy. So they're from the... So Doc Martens changed from their um, factory to like Thailand, and then all of their shoes started getting really awful. Yeah. And they would like fall apart really Is quickly. Right? And yeah, And I was going through like a pair every eight months. Yeah. So then I did some research, and basically these are made in what was the UK Dr. Martin factory. No shit. So yeah, yeah, they're, they're identical. they're like the quality that they used to be. No, they're, yeah, they're like identical. Yeah. Back when they paid people real wages. Ah, uh, is that right? I wouldn't know about that. I assume that when you move it to Thailand, it's because you want the wages to go down. Oh yeah, yeah, it's cheaper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. Yeah. All right. Of course it's 
Uh, it, it is not a good couch. I no, I mean, I don't know. It's, it's big. I, I got some cool couches for my new place. I bought these like red leather Chesterfields. I feel like that's, that, that's like everybody's like first go-to is like, you're like, I'm going to get a couch. I'm yeah, like, yeah. I was like, wow, I'm an I'm adult gonna, now. I'm like, literally, red, and I'm, I'm always talking leather. about them as yeah. well. And I'm always then, like, I've got these. <laughs> and, then you, and then you buy the red leather couch and then you realize <laughs> that no adult is really doing that. No. no. Really? Yeah, you, you're going to love it. I, I didn't realize that yet. You're going to love it for a while. I've had them for ages now. Why are you you're wearing you why are you wearing this Betsy Ross situation? It's a it's a USA I know, but you're the most British person here. Right? <laughs> own, I own know, your right? shit, yeah. Uh, I just like to wear it sometimes, like when I'm wearing double denim. You're like, I'm, I'm, you're like I'm fine everything I'm fine, everything's fine. I'm supposed to be here. I'm yeah. an American. Yeah, I'm like fine. <laughs> don't worry about me. <laughs> Undercover. <It's fine. laughs> yeah, yeah. Can you do an American accent? No. Try. I will not be doing that. Try. It's not happening. You can't even I try. Actually, I used to have a bit of one when I was a kid, yeah. actually. So I was actually born in America, and I was a bit back and forth. Yeah. But there was a time when I lived in America yeah. as a child. And I went to school in America, actually, for a bit. And, yeah, I used to, as you know, ch well, childs are, children are dickheads, aren't they? They just, children are really annoying, and they just, like, trying to be cool all the time. So that was you? And they're always like, yeah, and they put on accents and shit like that. And apparently, I had a bit of an American accent. And I'm like, oh, God, I sound like a douchebag. I'm really embarrassed about it. I'm telling everyone now. Yeah. I don't think you, I don't think anybody looks at you and goes, that's a douchebag. What, as a child? Yeah. <laughs> doing an American yeah, accent child, yeah. <laughs> at the age of four or five like or whatever. I feel like I you know. looked exactly the same as a child. Uh, no, I, I, like I didn't look no, exactly did you, the same you, as a child. <laughs> <laughs> Just a small No, version. I didn't. No, what did you look I like as a child? I definitely didn't. What did you look like as a child? Probably like a child. <laughs> 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 like, God, <laughs> fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> Probably like a child. Probably. How, uh, I was how, looking at it recently because I had to, because I was trying to get my US passport renewed, and I actually came around my UK one this time because I, I couldn't get. Are you you dual citizenship? Yeah. I fucking hate you. Fucking banging. Yeah. yeah. I'm trying to figure out how to get my uh, dual with Italy because nobody, nobody, ah. in, nobody in three generations has had it, so it's right. a bit of a process. Yeah. Are you, are, are you eligible? Well, for my brother's it? over in England, right? So he, so he can. He can benefit from having a, a yes. A, a, a it would be European good for him to get passport. that. It would right. be good, but yeah. I mean, well, we're, we're leaving you, you, unfortunately. But yeah, but he's over there traveling anyway, so he he's no, he has yeah. no ability to get a British passport. Either way, it's just an easier line. It's yeah, kinda like it's kind of like when I when I ha when I do um, South African and stuff, like American passports, pretty pretty high up. So when I go to oh like yeah, South I'm, Africa, I'm very to have one. I can just scoot through. Oh yeah. Because the American passport has a thing, and then we don't have to have visas in most places. You, your country's the only one that was like, fuck them with me. They like pulled me aside and they're like, you're not working here, are you? And I was like, no, 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 I'm not doing any work here. And they're like, you're a comedian, yeah? And I go, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's like, are you doing right. any shows? Like, no, 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 of course not. We don't not. like, like we we're don't on your like Instagram to laugh. right now. We don't like to be entertained. No, well, they went on your Instagram. No, but it's, no, they didn't. But it's the same vibe <laughs> as America, where it's like, you don't get to come here and make money. No, I know. And they like pressured me at the at the at the border, but no other country did that. I went to Morocco, and they're like, "We don't care, do whatever you want." They're like, "Hey, you're an American, just spend your money. We don't care." Yeah, yeah. I I was really I was a bit paranoid coming in because I came in on my UK passport on an ESTA, and I was just like, "Are they gonna think I'm working?" But they know. But I'm American. I can work here. Yeah. And I was just like, "Are they gonna know that I'm American? Are they gonna think I'm just a British person?" And they're gonna be like, "Are you working?" And they know everyone's coming here for the convention. Obviously, there's right. loads of people coming here from all over the world. You flew into LA. I did, yeah. They and don't then, know like, that there's they a porn like, convention. Oh, you're American. And they just waved me straight That's through. It, like, yeah. there was absolutely nothing. They went, like, are you working? And even if I was, the, then it would be fine. I can work here. I'm allowed. I yeah. have a social security number. Yeah, this is you. <laughs> like, you've done the, an American phone. You've done this whole, yeah, you've done this Because I lost whole, my phone. You've done this whole loop of, like, um, of like anxiety that nobody else was I know. In. That's, like, That's day to so day life. <laughs> <laughs> It's so funny. Literally. I do that too. I, I really, I like arc myself up uh, oh my to a level God. that doesn't make any sense. Yeah, I do it constantly. And I've been doing it a lot here. This has been stressful. <laughs> this has been a lot. Yeah, for you, you yeah. You, um... Yeah, without without saying without without saying what it was on here, like yeah, like uh, I was asking for a favor, and you were like, "Oh, I'll just keep checking back in," and I was like, "No, just let them, just let them like figure it out. Uh -huh. don't, don't keep poking them in the eye, because people are like, if you keep asking, they're gonna be like, yeah, yeah, annoying. yeah. No, you're right. I, I didn't, I didn't. Yeah. Like, because well, that's the most I sent you before your phone before your phone uh, died or got stolen or whatever whatever it was. Yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, like, well, I left it on the microwave. But also, but it's the same. It. But it's the same anxiety with me. As like, if she keeps asking, then it's gonna. It's no, gonna I know. I think you're like totally right. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> completely. <laughs> like, you're totally right. I mean, I think the name. Yeah. So wait, are you staying? 
the whole time at the same place till February? Or you um, don't know yet? No. So I've got, I'm completely open. So I booked it until the like Monday yeah. or Tuesday. And then, and then I Ginger haven't booked accommodation. Yeah, yeah. She's going home. That's Vancouver. And then I haven't booked accommodation yet because I just thought, ah, I don't know what I'll do. Maybe I'll go back to LA. I don't know. So I've got this week where I haven't got any plans yeah. right now, basically. So I don't know. We'll see if we fucking see what happens. What are you, what are you into that, that happens in Vegas? I don't know, really. Yeah. Like, I, I never really thought Vegas would be my kind of place, mm -hmm. to be honest with you. Um, and it is pretty weird. Yeah. But I'd like to find something that I like about it. <laughs> okay. It has all yeah. the things. Here's what I did learn about Vegas that is very specific and interesting about this town is um, people don't, like, they the, s the same businesses are, are repeated, like, every five miles. So you can, like, live in, like, a little bubble across town so like what happens is like i went to a diner last night and then the yeah. was a, i was with a vegas person and they were like oh no there's a bunch of these like it's a chain and i looked it up and it's like there's there's four so it's the same family-owned restaurant but they put it on all the corners of vegas so that everybody can like get to it ah. because i was staying on one i was staying on this side of town and yeah. all the people that, were that generally people want to be on this side of town and so all the people that were on this side of town were like i'm not coming to get you on this side of town right and they go, Just come get me. the traffic the is fucked well so the, yeah so it's like so the middle is where the strip is yeah and then there's all the corners of the thing so people want to live on the corners of this town yeah they yeah really, honestly they, they just want to live on this side this is called summerlin over here they just want to live yes here. i asked an uber driver where's good places to live in vegas yeah. and they said summerlin everybody thinks the summerlin is the place i yeah. was in henderson and people were like we're not going to henderson to come get you oh yeah <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but it was cool. It was really cool over there. I really liked living over there for yeah. the, for the week. But no, but Summerlin. Everybody wants to live in Summerlin to the effect that people are that are not living in Summerlin are claiming they live in Summerlin. Oh. Like it's like the next two the next two three communities. Oh my god! Yes, yeah, it's okay. serious out here. Yeah, it's desirable. But yeah, so you have to have f you have to have four businesses in this town to be successful because if you just have one business, nobody's going to it. Okay. You gotta have something near the strip in case. And then for the locals, you gotta have the other ones. That's so interesting. I think that's just because the traffic's so bad. Maybe. The traffic's horrendous. Is it? Is it? You yeah. were just in LA. Oh, I had an amazing Uber driver the other day. Yeah. And like I was in a traffic jam with her for like half an hour. So. I thought I thought the price of cabs here was a little uh, a little a lot. Yeah, it is a bit. It's like a dollar a minute, which is pretty high. Even like I live in New York City. I don't. Do you not get Ubers? Not really. I don't like cabs. I don't uh, like the vibe. Everybody thinks when I say cab that Uber's a different thing. It's I yeah. I, did, I mean it the same. Yeah. I don't like it. I never I, did. I'm I'm tired of Ubers in London. I I was always getting Ubers instead of the tube because of I don't know laziness and anxiety. Yeah. And like I just got to a point where I'm so bored of sitting in cars for yeah. ages. So I started getting the tube again and the bus it's again. Fun. And I'm like, wow, this is amazing. It's fun. And it's I did like the bus the whole first time I was in Vegas. Yeah. The problem here is like it what is what is it's just the the gaps don't make sense. So what is a twenty minute uh, car ride is yeah. a two-hour bus I, oh because, God, it's, yeah, because it's the buses only go up and, and, and across. It's just not very well equipped, really. Yeah, nobody yeah. here had like like the the also the the crew that takes the buses is is, yeah. is relatively seedy in Vegas. Oh, like they're the ones who stole your bus. phone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> maybe let's go get it. I'll find let's it. Let's go run around the bus. I was thinking when I went to a pawn shop to buy a phone today that I was going to find my. Is phone. that what you did? Yeah, yeah. Oh, this is a pawn shop. Second hand. Yeah. Oh. oh. Yeah. That's smart. Mm. I like that. Well, how close is a pawn shop? Well, I actually went to three before I found a phone. Oh. Well yeah, so I got... You could so you, like, so you bought a gun at the first one. Oh, God. <laughs> Somebody's uh, like, like heirloom <laughs> watch at the second <laughs> one. And then your phone at the third yeah. one. Yeah. Oh. That's wild, and they switch you five hundred bucks. But you're done. You're you, the five. It's good. It's really good. It's yeah. the newest one. It's just like Samsung. And then they activated it for you. Yeah, yeah. They gave me a SIM card. That's the newest phone, but somebody already gave it up. So you got a, you got a. Yeah, I know, right? It's got a case on it. It's pretty cool. Yeah, the camera's good. It looks good. So yeah, it literally was somebody stole it and then pawned it. My phone. You've so no this one. You have somebody else's stolen phone now. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the I circle of it. life <laughs> continues. That's not. It's this fine. It's funny. Yeah, yeah. I I am. Um, I'm a bit sad. I lost all my photos on my uh, my other phone. Yeah, I've been taking so many up? photos. I I guess so. Yeah, if I if I get another iPhone, I log into there. Yeah, you know, it's just so how so. many phones does one person need? It's getting like chaos here, to be honest yeah. with you. But um, yeah, I'll try and get them. They should be on the iClouds or whatever. Is that a thing? I think so. Yeah, that's the thing. Yeah, I logged into it earlier to do find my iPhone, 
And it what was like, say? you said your phone's offline. Someone sold it for crack. Yeah, I don't understand how that's still the answer. It's like, why yeah. is fi- I find my phone a thing if it doesn't work, if they just shut the phone off? I know, right? Just turn it off. If you're stealing a phone, just turn it off. Just give it a little bit extra power so that it's like, because like, the GPS can I find know. it even if you're out of service. On my... Um, I have a Hawaii, 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 Hawaii. Don't know what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> the phone that's called like the phone brand that's called like Hawaii. Yeah, we don't have like it here. Huawei. Yeah, it's, it's everywhere else in the country. Yeah. It's really funny. Is it banned? Yeah. Well, oh. no, your services don't cover it. Oh no, Google doesn't cover it here. Oh. Yeah, which is weird. Um, yeah, it's like the main one. So yeah, I everywhere. have, I so have one. Yeah. And the alarm goes off even when it's turned off. Yeah. Which is amazing. I think the iPhone the alarm will, do that. will go off. My old phone used to do that. My well, then flip why phone. can't find my iPhone do that? That's then. what I'm wondering. Yeah. You know, that would have been great. That's what I'm saying. I That's mean, maybe I'll get back and they'll be standing uh, outside the hostel. Like, yeah. How many? Is it a hostel? How yeah, many, we got a two. A yeah, we, it's Tindra. Ah. Fucking <laughs> like she she chose it, and I was like, yeah. No and then problem. I got there, and I was like, what? I mean, obviously we have, you, a, you have your own room. No, we have a private room. Yeah, yeah, a room with two queen beds. It's a big room, and the, yeah. it's clean, and the beds are comfy. But, but it hostel. is in a hostel. Yeah. And they were like, uh, it said there was breakfast included. So I went down on the first day. I was there on my own Tindra the day after me. Um. So I arrived late at night and I was like, fuck. And the Uber driver was like, this is a dangerous part of town, you know? Yeah. And I was well, like, that doesn't fuck. help you. He just put that in your head. It, it looked pretty dangerous yeah. to me. And well, it, so because it's because it's their building shit, there's like chunks where there's nothing yeah, there's and that doesn't lot. make it good. Yeah. Uh, opposite, there's like three motels that have been bought out. Yeah. Oh, you're but in I, that part. Yeah. But I was going to tell you about the breakfast. Yeah. So... <laughs> It's just dry. We saved it's so just much money with this. Like I was like, yeah, because Tinder's, just Tinder's dry really gluten. thrifty, and it's okay. a good influence. I love me that because I'm not. It's a good word. So I was like, yeah, let's stay there and save money. And like, well, I had to buy a new phone now, so I guess like fair enough. But maybe I wouldn't have lost it if I was here. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, breakfast. If so you changed said, anything, yeah, well, then you wouldn't have lost it. Let me tell you about the breakfast. Yeah, so I'm it listening. said there was breakfast. <laughs> <included>. <laughs> I'm listening. <laughs> it said there was breakfast included. Um, so I went down. And I said to them, I was like, oh, yeah, what's breakfast? She was like, through there. And I went in and I, d- I, s- I saw no breakfast. So I was like, and I, and I thought, I don't want to. No, you didn't see no breakfast. What did you see? Oh, I, I didn't see anything that I felt was at breakfast. So I was like, am I going insane? And you thought you are in the wrong room. I was like, what? So I went back and I was like, sorry. Like, because <laughs> I'm British, everything sounds like but is a it massive okay, sarcastic okay. So complaint. What, yeah, of course. But wait, so what is, what is, what is traditional English breakfast? Um, I, well, you know, in, in a hotel in England, you'd probably expect to have a continental breakfast at minimum. And which maybe is, if which you're is lucky, what? which is what? You know, like a couple of croissants. Yeah. Uh, Oatmeal. Yeah. Cereal. Some cereals and coffee. some fruits and like yeah. maybe toast and preserves. Sure. Like, yeah. So I didn't see anything. That's bare minimum. Like no protein at all. So then what did, what did they have? Well, I went, so I went back and I was like, sorry. Um, what? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why she thought I was being sarcastic. In an I ass. was like, is that what? I, I can't see it. And she yeah. was like, oh, okay. So there's only pancakes and oatmeal, but there isn't any oatmeal. So it's only pancakes. Oh. And you just press a the button, then it comes out. And I was like, what? Okay. That's pretty good. So there's this, there's this, is this machine. And it's like a... It's like a 60s looking, like, cookware, yeah. futuristic kind of machine. It can't be both of those and you things. press this. It is, because it's like that time when people were making weird electronics. Okay. So, it, okay, I see what you're saying now. Yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, like, you press a button, mm-hmm. and then it just, like, dollops some uh, batter. Yeah. And then it slowly goes along this conveyor belt. And then it Can falls you video out. this? And it's like that big, really small. Can and you it video does you this too. For me? I did, but I lost my phone. I'll, oh, <laughs> I'll video it again tomorrow. Yeah. Wait, so um, it's so it it the whole t- it's already been a pancake the whole time it's going through gravity. It's going through like a hot a hot conveyor belt. Yeah. So it's like meh, But so but when does it become the shape of a pancake? When it first when, when, when it first splats when down. The, yeah, when the batter drops. It never gets Because it's a very small amount of batter. Pinched. No, it's just a very small amount of batter. And, and so then the gravity just spreads it out. So was it good? It was all right. I mean, I, I, I only ate it for the novelty. I was like, I gotta try this out. Like, it's I don't great. really eat like stuff like that. I didn't really enjoy it, but yeah, I just wanted to see it. That's pretty good. Um, this yeah. So that's what they're offering. And it's like it said, there's breakfast included. That's not really like, 
You know? <laughs> <laughs> I do know. It's not really cocoonish, is you're it? Saying. Like, you've got the weird pancake machine. I don't know where that came from. Probably from a pawn shop. In yeah, here. I bet. Like, yeah. An old diner. They were like, hey, up. guys, we got this. Now we can put it on the I've website never, that yeah, we I've provide breakfast, which yeah, they don't. Yeah. Yeah. I try to stay in this hotel once outside of this convention. And then I Googled and all of the things that they were claiming they had like a pool that were all closed and gone. So I was like, I had to call back and be like, hey, I can't stay where the, none of the things that you said exist, exist. What, this hotel, the Hard this Rock? This hotel, yeah. It's it's closing down. It's going to turn into a virgin hotel. Yeah, yeah, your guy, your guy bought it. My guy. Yes, anything British. You My get, you guy. Can, yeah, anything British is yours. <laughs> um, oh, yeah, Richard Branson bought it. Including the horse fucking lady. The horse fucking lady, <laughs> yeah. The, the, the queen. Foxes. The queen. <laughs> <laughs> Fox horses, yeah. from what I know. Yeah, well, and what, and what, I don't, and what, don't, and what know don't I know? Who Look told that. you this? That's, that's fine. Oh. Um, so the, um, yeah, so he, well, so what happened was they, they, they held it a year. Yeah. Because this is their biggest event. Yeah. So they bought it and they wanted to flip it and they said, we're going to hold because AVN's coming. So they're going to try to get it fixed by next year, but I don't think it's going to happen. So the, I don't know, I don't know what the new plan is. Maybe it'll move, I don't know. It's, I, think um, it, I think it might have it to. It said it would be by November. That they'll know by November. No, it's. I thought it would be redone by November. Yeah, but well, that's, not realistic. that's not realistic. That's not realistic. They're not just going to get the carpets up and put something else in, aren't they? They're not going to change it very much. Well, uh, apparently, right now the pool isn't isn't up and running. I think that's to change everything. And then if it's not going to be the Hard Rock, they got to pull all this shit out front. I know, right? That massive. They got to get rid of the guitar. <laughs> Where's that going? Is that going to be know. in the pawn shop? I don't know. Like they change all the banners. Make a nicer parking it. garage. He got to do all the things. Like he's got to put his van, his virgin shit on it. He's got to put a um a, a, a I mean, they will obviously completely redecorate. He has it. to put a um a, a shuttle what? on the rooftop so he can go to Mars from here. Yeah, yeah, he's got to do all the things. They have to they have to create um with now with the the Raiders coming and the yeah, I saw the stadium. Mobile arena. They have to c they have to come up with a with a uh, like a a decent sized like venue space too. No yeah. The way it the way it's set up downstairs is a m you, did you go? It's a little bit yeah, of a mess. Yeah, I was signing yesterday for adult time, yeah. which was amazing. It's it a was bit of a mess down there cool. though, because it's because it too is, many rooms is, and stuff. It is. Yeah, sorry, my shorts are just like not. I think it's all we, what we want. In a good place. I think it's what we want. It's just not in a good place right now. This um, is this is the uh, the front <laughs> wedgie podcast. <laughs> yeah. That's what we're going for. Yeah, totally. So. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I have been down there. I was signing yesterday. Uh, I was going. I'm signing today. I was going to be doing twelve till four, but I arrived. You wrote your schedule on the back. And I'd lost my phone. No. Yeah. I thought you. Were I know. I was. I thought you were studying. I don't know why I was holding it. Um, yeah. And I arrived and I lost my phone. And I was trying to like hold it together. And then I got there. And then like I was trying to send this email quickly. And then this. <coughs> The lady who's running the booth like spoke to me and I just burst into tears and was like, oh my God, I lost my phone. Ah. This morning? Yeah. So then she was like, look, do you want to do four till eight instead? Like go get a phone. Yeah. And I was like, okay. And Brie Mills was there and I've been like, I'm a huge fan. Yeah. And I've been like dying to meet her. And you cried And right then I like cried in front of Brie Mills. So funny. I've been like dying to meet her. Like, I went to her talk at Expos and it was fucking amazing. And yeah. I was like, oh my God, I really want to say hi to Brie Mills. And yesterday, all day, I was like, oh my God, am I going to beat Brie Mills? And, and then, then today, I just cried in front, of her. in front of her. I just cried in front of her and then left and went to ball. <laughs> 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 she well was that's probably not like, what you oh. wanted to do. Like, like, she, it looked like she was kind of coming over and then went, oh. Oh, <laughs> like, someone's crying. Like, yeah. Someone's crying. I got to go. Someone's crying. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> amazing. Um. I have to do. I have to check in on one person. Uh, yeah. Because we're run. Um, on Delano. Um. So how do we follow you? How do we pay for your porn? Um. Uh. I mean, yes? it, it does, does anyone pay for porn on this? Who listens to this yeah. podcast? I mean, I, I hope so. People do pay for my porn. I yes. mean, I, it's literally my job. Like, yes. I start paying my rent. How do we uh, do that? Like, what I would urge is actually go on my porn hub. Yes. Because I want to get my race scout. Whatever so whatever you need there. to plug, plug it right now. Yeah, just search <laughs> me in there. Hello, how are you? <laughs> Hi. But, well, tell us how to search you and how to spell everything. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. I'll put it on the screen. It's written on the sakes. screen that you're on. <laughs> like, I don't need to. <laughs> come, like, it's written there. All right. I'm always spelling it. I'm bored right, of spelling my name. Fine. Too fine. late to change it. Uh, check out her website, yeah, eelfucker.com. <laughs> <laughs> I am a Stella Bathory. <laughs> Eleanor Bathwater, as my friend said the other week. But you also Eleanor have your also your Twitter is like calling yourself a cunt. That's my Instagram. Yeah, that's all right. So just 
<laughs> 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 figure, figure out where she's at, I guess. Um, thank you guys for listening and watching. We're on uh, Google Play. We're on iTunes. If you switch platforms like you did, uh, we're on the other thing. We got some fun content today on uh, YouTube. We're on uh, Spotify. We're on all Are the you? things. We're on all the things. Oh, my goodness. We drop a new episode every Monday. Wow. Uh, this is the, you're one of the one of only maybe f- a handful of people that have, that have gotten a repeat episode. So Fuck yeah. yeah. Oh, I love um, a high five. Yeah. It's America right there. America. It's a white America person and thing. Is what yeah, it is. It's in, it's, well, that's the, the home of the home of white people is America. And then if you're uh, if you're from England, then you fuck horses. So that's what we've learned today on this podcast. Especially if you're the if if you are the the the, 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 monas- uh, the monastery. That's not that's not the word. The monarchy. Um, so check out all those things. I'm gonna make you do some like like a, like a physical challenge here in a second. Oh. So check that out on Instagram. Uh, okay. I don't know what else. I think I plugged all the things. Thank you guys for listening and watching. Thank you. Thank you.